guess what we are up to. Say hello to my ice guana. Full detail. to the scales. Got you, Ice Guana. Hi, Guana friends. <laughs> this is a special edition for our northern friends. If you are out of Minnesota, out of Canada, out of Maine, and all of our northern friends right now that are stuck on the couch and it's freezing cold outside, you're tired of watching Jessica have all the fun shooting all the iguanas, you and your air rifle are snuggled up on the couch and we have the iguana solution for you. You need to get ready to dust off old NyQuil the Springer and have some fun because we have the most awesome solution. Introducing Ice Guana. Ice Guana is a full-size replica of an authentic iguana from South Florida. You can create your own target-rich environment that you dream of while stuck in the cold. Shoot from the warmth of your own back window of your house while you knock ice guanas off of the fence, off of the shed in the back. Sneaky ice guanas might be on the boat. Don't trust those ice guanas. Get your ice guana today and knock them out. We've spotted an ice guana on the fence. Don't trust them. Ice guanas are everywhere. Oh, we, we spotted an ice guana in the flower pot. Don't trust it. Trying to hide behind the rock. Oh, don't trust them. Gonna eat all the flowers. Gonna get you, ice guana. Oh no, ice guana on the mother-in-law's car. Well, we don't have to worry about a backstop now. Ice guanas on the shed. Easy target, get a backstop going, pop him off, don't trust him, ice guanas. Hey guana friends, we have our ice guana set up in the yard, this is our first time to try to shoot them, we're just using the concept light right now. We have our new Range Master pellets, courtesy of Air Guns of Arizona. They're 18 grain. I usually shoot around 13, 14 grain. So these are bigger pellets. We're gonna shoot at normal settings for us, which is the second setting. And so we're really shooting right at 18 pounds since we have these pellets in. We're gonna try to hit our ice guana. He's about 20 yards away, maybe a little less, like 18. I'm shooting a little high with these pellets. I'm not used to them yet. Oh, take that ice guana! Got a second ice guana. He just snuck up over here trying to eat our flowers. He's right there in the grass. We got a nice backstop over there. Shooting at 18 foot pounds with those range masters. Oh, they shoot high, or I shoot high with them. Oh my god, the wind. Oh, take that! Took his head off. Hang on, let's see if we can take the heart out. So, 
Uh, Steve over at uh, Air Gun Evolution says you shoot right in front of the foreleg to hit the heart. There! <laughs> Took his heart out too. Got you, Iguana. Ice Guana. <laughs> We got the ice guana. Look at this. We just knocked him off. Just knocked this block off for real. So they hold up really well in the uh, the heat. To be honest, he still looks very much iguana y So this is our guy. We knocked his head off at first. Hit him up here. So that part shattered, I guess. And then our other ice guanas over here watering the plants. He didn't fare so well either. You can see this is the hind end here. Ice guanas are the best. They show up anywhere. All right, we just gotta show y'all ice guanas come in all kinds of varieties. If you have your ice guana mold, you can have orange alpha iguanas, rare blue ice guanas. They show up anywhere. You can make a target rich environment. It's great times. All right guys, so we've spotted an alpha orange iguana, ice guana in the tree right here. And just above him is a nice looking blue one. So we're gonna see if we can pop them off real quick. He's only about 15 yards, if that. Knock his head off. We're gonna hit him in the heart now. Ooh. <laughs> And then we got um, a blue one up there. We got a move, so we got the back stop. Nice head shot right here. He's like a volunteer iguana we usually get. I get below him, that was embarrassing. Knocked his block off. Got you, ice iguana. Man, we've got one of these zombie ice iguanas right here. He just will not come down. So we're gonna go ahead and hit him again. We've already popped him a few times. He's actually upside down in the tree. Got you, Ice Guana. <laughs> Got you, Iguana. <laughs> Two roof iguanas right here. We got a roof Ice Guana, an orange one, and it looks like a regular Ice Guana. Only about 15 yards away. Earlier when we were shooting in the tree, it was only about 8 to 10 yards away. I was off. And it would help. Got you, Ice Guana, right in the head. Got you, Ice Guana. <laughs> oh my there. goodness. I'm gonna shoot that orange one one more time for fun. That's what you do with ice blocks. <laughs> Got you, ice blocks. Okay, our tree iguana is just not going out. He's one of those zombie iguanas. You see him still holding one of the tree with no head, like a chicken. So we're gonna go ahead and try to pop him right between the shoulders. There we go. Ice iguana down. 